Well, welcome back, everybody. I'm glad you guys are joining me today. And I don't think Chicago can ever elect a good mayor. Heck, we just came out for Lori Lightfoot for so long, and now we get this other brain uh, rocket scientist, this uh, galaxy brain that we have there in charge in, in, in Chicago. And it reminds me back in 2017, maybe there's some truth to this. Maybe, maybe Chicago is MAGA country, uh, because that's how Democrats try to betray it. They try to portray that uh, <laughs> that that MAGA is in, infiltrated into uh, Chicago, these Democrat cities, and somehow these Democrats continue to get elected. And I, I don't know, maybe MAGA just goes away on on uh, election day. They maybe they don't show up to uh, to vote uh, because somehow leftists continue to get elected there, and then they get blamed for the leftists being there. It's, I know it's hilarity, right? Uh, so what we have here is the current Chicago mayor blaming MAGA for. Uh, the city's crime problems for the uh, for everything that's happening uh, for the problems of Chicago. It's the right wing's fault. It's MAGA's fault. It's Trump's fault. It's the populist's fault. It's everybody's fault but the Democrats' fault. You know, Democrats only want democracy. That's all they want, right? They want the utopia. They want equality. They want all this great stuff. It's just those far right racist MAGA people that are just it's uh, they're they're ruining it all for everybody, and they have no power apparently in these cities, and yet they're still ruining it. Jesse Smollett was right. Chicago is MAGA country. So let's go ahead and take a look at the story. But before we do, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe button. If you're new here, thanks for joining me. Allow me to share some info with you. Hopefully, you can share it with your friends and family. Smash that like button, 1,500 likes. If you like the content, you like the video, you like the channel, you can smash that join button or you can smash that super thanks as well. So let's go ahead and dive into what we have here. Uh, coming to us from Breitbart, Chicago Mayor Brandon Johnson blames the right wing extremists for the city's problems. Uh, dude, dude almost looks like Lori Lightfoot. <laughs> anyway, uh, Chicago Mayor Brandon Johnson blames the right wing extremists for the, some of the uh, some of the ills of his crime ridden city. Johnson issued a statement about the far right during his press conference on Tuesday. What we've seen is a very raggedy form of right wing extremists. The mayor said, "Everyone knows that the right wing extremists in this country have targeted Democrat." run cities. And quite frankly, they have been quite intentional about going after Democratic ran cities that are led by people of color. Of course, of course. Yes. Yes, of course we are. Right. The mayor even said that such right wing extremists aims to create division and chaos because that is what uh, that particular political party has been about. So is that is it is, is, is MAGA causing the black on black crime is, is MAGA causing the uh, the uh, record numbers of of uh, black people shooting each other every night, every weekend in Chicago is, is that what's happening, Mayor? Mayor, is it is, is that is that is MAGA? Are, are they wearing MAGA caps? I, I think so. Did somebody yell MAGA. This is MAGA country, dude. I think you might be onto something. What an idiot! This is the same party that wouldn't accept President Obama was actually an American. This is the same Republican right wing extremists that stormed the Capitol. It's the same right-wing extremist that refuses to accept the result of the Civil War. It's raggedy. It's disrespectful. It's mean-spirited, he said. Was he crying? Was he crying as he said that? Because it would have been awesome if he was. It's an ensemble. And it's an affront to everything that is good about this country for extremists in this country to use people as political tools to settle political scores for something that happened over 400 years ago. They're still mad that the black man is free in this country. He added, <laughs> what a moron. But of course, this is what the mainstream media uh, believes, right? This is what most Democrats believe. This is what most of the uh, university's led professors believe. And they try to push it onto your children as they send them off to universities to get educated. And then they find out that, hey, I really hate myself. And I guess uh, I guess MAGA does. Uh, I guess Chicago is MAGA country and, and Philadelphia and all these other uh, Democrat lips. They're, they're all MAGA country. How did I miss that? How did I miss that? Oh, I don't know. I, you know, in, in some of the cities I drive, uh, drive through, I don't have to lock my car doors when I go through. And there's some other cities, cities that are ran by MAGA country uh, people. Got got to lock those doors. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe maybe he's on to something, right? What a hilarious. Kids don't smoke crack. Anyway, let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Of course, you guys can follow me on all my social media, including the Odyssey, Gab, Twitter, all those places in the description down below. 
Don't forget to hit that like, subscribe button. And until next time, I'll see you guys later. Have a great, great day.